In this video, you'll learn to create an automatic door for your player. I'll be using this free asset from the Unity Store for the tutorial. To make it quick and easy, let's understand the concept first. For the door to open, we'll create three animations for it. First one is going to be an idle animation where the door stays closed. Second one will be the animation where the door opens. And the third one will be an idle animation where the door stays open. Then, we'll calculate the distance between the player and the door. And if the player is close enough to the door, we'll change the door's animation from close to open. Let's get started. Here I have a simple game with no door or whatsoever. First, drag and drop your door in the scene. Now, to create the three animations, add an animator component to your door. Then go to the Windows tab and enable the Animation window. Here, while the door is selected, click on the Create button, and name the animation whatever you like. We'll keep this animation empty as it's the closed idle animation. Now, create another animation, and hit the record button. This is going to be our door opening animation. Move the time frame anywhere near 50, and open the door in the scene window. Then stop recording. Now we'll create our last animation, where the door stays open. For this animation, copy the last event from the second animation using Ctrl plus C. Then come back to the third animation, hit the record button and paste the event in the beginning, as well as in the ending. Stop recording and we are done with creating the animations. Now select the door and double click on its animator in the inspector window. Here, right click on the first animation and join it with the second one, then join the second with the third. As you can see the transition has no conditions. To create one, we'll create a bool in the parameter tab. Now select the transition arrow between 1 and 2 and set the condition as the bool that we created as true. So now, whenever the bool is true, the gate will open. Also make sure there is no condition between the second and the third animation. Now, create a script. Here, declare the animator, the player, and the door. Now with the update function we'll calculate the distance between the player and the gate. And if the distance is less than or equal to, let's say 25, we'll set the bool that we created, as true. And also, we'll use else statement to set it to false and avoid any errors. Now in Unity, drag and drop the script on the door. Then drag and drop the animator, player and the door in the script. Now if I hit play, It works perfectly fine. You can also close the door when the player is far away, using the same approach. We're just 1.59 million subscribers away from Brackies. Click that button.